God bless you. Good evening to you this Sunday evening. As I was taking my leisure, waking up from my nap, this, this, this thought came to me as I'm scrolling down Facebook. What did you go to church to get today? What did you go to church to get from the Lord today? He said, I'm going to the church to get something from the Lord. That was said. I'm going to get something from the Lord. Did you get it? Did you get it? Say, I'm going to church to meet the Lord. Did you meet him? Was he there? What did you go to church to get? And did you get it? And did you reject what the Lord had for you? Did you receive it? Did you reject it? Was you paying attention? I'm going to church with my cup out. Did it get filled? What did it get filled with? Let me see. Let me see some. Let me see some. Let me see. I won't see some. Hebrew ten twenty five. Assemble yourself together. See, not forsaking the assembly of ourselves together as the matter of Psalm is, but exhorting one another. Was you exhorted? Was you exhorted in church today? Was you exhorted? Let me go get my get my get my Bible. I didn't pull that up. Let me go get get my Bible so I can really see what you supposed to get or what and what you supposed to expect when you gather together. You supposed to expect something. Bye 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 bye. Man, I feel the Holy Ghost. Hebrew 1025. Matter of fact, I guess I'll I got something up. I guess I'll do do this today. Hebrew 1025. Let's see. Not for sake of the assembly of ourselves together as a man of some bill, but exhorting one another. Were you exhorted? And so much more as ye see the day approaching. 24. Let us consider one another and provoke one another to love and to good works. When you went to church today, when you assembled yourself together today, did you exhort one another? It's a one another. It didn't say just the pat just the one man or one woman that's over the building. It's a you exhort one another. That means you have more than one speaker. Ain't that right? Exhorting one another. That's 25. 24. Let us consider one did you consider did you consider one another? Did you give attention to what your brother, your sister had to say? Did you pay them any attention? Boy, this is good. 
provoke or to love. Did you provoke people to love one another and not hate one another and not have respect of person? And to forgive one another and esteem one another how you do yourself? Did you do that when you gather, when you assemble yourself together? And to good work, were you provoked to do good works? Or were you provoked to continue to sin? What were you, you assembled together? If that didn't happen, if you didn't receive that today, when you assembled, when you went to church, if you if that didn't happen about you, Provoke one another. Exalt one another. It's a one another. It, that be it more than one speaker. Your, your pastor is not the only one speaking. Other folks speaking. You exalted and provoking one another to good work. You, not only is you gonna hear from the from the pastor of the building, you go you gonna hear from the one sitting beside you, he or she. You gonna hear from them, and they gonna they gonna provoke you to do good, to don't sin, to be holy, without spot, resist the devil, obey God, fear God. Did that happen when you assemble yourself today? Now, back in the Old Testament, my God, God had an appointed place where they were to go and give all the sacrifices to God. The burnt of burnt offerings and all that kind of thing. In no more specific places now, Jesus said in this place, no is a ruler should they come in where you swear not worship God. God is a spirit. Not a location. They that wish me must wish me in spirit and in truth. No certain days. No Sabbath day. What did you go to church for today? What you assemble yourself together for? Did this happen? Was the pastor the only one that had something to say today? If he would, you want to assemble together? No, you want other folk go and go provoke you and esteem you and consider you, provoke you to good works. It's a provoke one another. What did you go to church for today? What did you go for today? That's enough. God bless you. Thank you for hearing. Did you? Did you hear words that came against your mess? Did you hear repent? Did you hear re remission of sin? Did you hear fear God? All that. What did you go to church for today? Did you get what you went for? You had your cup out what it feel? Or did you say, I don't want this? Or did you reject this? What you go for today? All right, that's enough of that. God bless you. Thank you for it.